The anesthesiology team looks forward to making you comfortable for your upcoming shoulder surgery. The basic anesthetic approach to shoulder surgery is general anesthesia. You will receive medication to keep you comfortable and unaware throughout the surgery. An anesthesiologist and a nurse anesthetist will work together to monitor you throughout the surgery. If appropriate, you will be offered a peripheral nerve block in addition to the general anesthesia. The purpose of the nerve block is to reduce pain after surgery. These blocks are usually performed before you go into the operating room. The anesthesia team will discuss this procedure in the holding area prior to surgery. A portable ultrasound is used to visualize the nerves that travel from your neck to your arm. An injection of local anesthetic is placed in the area which blocks the cluster of these nerves for approximately 12 to 14 hours. This single shot nerve block injection with concentrated medication significantly reduces pain and numbs your arm. In some cases, in addition to the single shot nerve block injection, you may also be offered a continuous nerve block. A small tube called a catheter is left under the skin lying next to the nerves that travel from your neck down to your arm. You will be sent home with a catheter in place. A reservoir with medication is connected to the catheter. This will slowly release diluted local anesthetic close to the nerves of the shoulder over two to three days. After the initial single shot injection with concentrated medication fades out, you will begin to feel discomfort. This is normal. At this time, you will transition to more diluted medication delivered through the catheter. Our goal is to keep your pain within the tolerable range, which falls in the low to moderate pain levels of zero to four when using the pain scale. The anesthesia block team has nurse practitioners that will educate you regarding how to care for the pain catheter at home. If you have any questions about your shoulder surgery anesthesia, please contact our office. Thank you.